on your ramps board there will be two places that you put power the first one it says 5 amps that's for your electronics and then the next one says 11 amps and that one is for heaters so you're going to need two sets of 12 volt power to come in if you get an under voltage situation especially on your electronics uh, your electronics can fry if your power wires are too long or too small is the 12 volts from your power supply by the time when it gets up here and it's getting pulled down on a heater the voltage can drop so you want to keep your wires as short as possible and really as big as possible I'm using some number 14 SO hopefully it's big enough uh, I used number 12 on my rep wrap but it that wire wasn't as flexible this is real nice and flexible and then I'm going to use some number uh, 16 uh, this is from a power cord. I'm going to use this for the 5 volt um, for the electronics and then the number 14 will be for the heaters. It says PS on, power supply on. This uh, green wire is what makes the uh, power supply switch on. So I'm going to just uh, permanently connect it to a black wire. This will make it so I can just turn it on with the switch here. I don't really have the right connector. I was going to use a butt splice, but uh, I'm all out of those. This will certainly work. Alright, so I have some yellow and black wires. This is going to be what we power our wrap wrap with. So I'm twisting these wires together and then uh, soldering them. I would definitely leave a little more wire to work on here. This is pretty tight. So be very careful that your wires are right. We've got positive negative, positive negative, positive negative, positive negative. So double check, triple check. Mm. 
be sure to check your voltages. Make sure it all looks good.